So you had to finish the play, obviously, but Zoe did a lot of work there, too. Yeah. Just describe how that developed from your perspective. Uh, Zoe made a great defensive effort, got the ball off the center back, and um, as soon as I saw her break free, I kind of, I knew she was going to get the cross off, so I just sprinted as hard as I can, and she found me, so props to her. Yeah, did it feel like teammates yeah. are kind of making your job easy as, as yeah. the finisher? <laughs> yeah. What's it like to benefit from that and, and, and kind of be able to reward their hard work? Mm -hmm. It's really nice, um, but like the important thing is, it doesn't matter really who does the work, but as long as we're getting the results. <laughs> so you guys open conference play with a win. Yeah. How different does that feel? And, and you know, this isn't the first time you've had a strong non-conference, but how does it feel mm -hmm. to carry it over then into conference yeah. play this time? It feels amazing that um, all the hard work and everything we've learned from the preseason is um, being carried over into season, and it's really nice to see uh, how cohesive as a group our team is working and um, I think it shows on the field. Utah seemed to have you guys really pinned back towards the end of the first mm -hmm. half. Kat said she switched up some things. What did she try to do? What did you guys try to do to come out stronger in the second half? Yeah, um, Utah <laughs> did have us pinned for a little bit, but uh, Kat made it a note to press the center backs really hard and um, that's exactly what Zoe did and we scored off of it, so yeah. Cool. Thank you. Thank Thanks you guys.